we'll always remember you when. That's a phrase you hear a lot when someone makes it big. And this morning, News Channel 5's Chris Davis and photojournalist Mike Rose have an update to a story we first brought you more than 25 years ago. Now this hometown artist has just made his debut on Nashville's biggest stage. It's sound check time at the Ryman Auditorium. And while there are plenty of good views from the pews, these people that I'm sharing the stage with are the best people I've ever met. This might be the best seat in the house. Because the lead singer may stand in the spotlight and the guitarist gets the solos. But it's up to these guys to keep everyone on time. And what a time this is for Isaac Eady. It's amazing. We're going to play however we're feeling right then and there. You ain't ever going to catch two nights the same. A native of Tullahoma making his debut in this hallowed hall. My entire family will be in tonight, and that's everything for me to you know, get to play for them at the Ryman, of all places. Using the instrument, he's been playing for more than just a beat. That's my heart. <laughs> That's my soul right there, man. I love the drums. It's just a lifelong relationship with this instrument that I just love so much. But for any good song to start, yeah. Yeah. you have to count in the beginning. He was exposed to music in the womb, and he, he's always been around music. We first met Isaac in the early 90s when he was shorter than a snare drum. He would just really perk up to the sound of music. Sixteen years later, Isaac's tempo didn't slow down. As Isaac grew, so did his skills. But not his ego, at least if his family had anything to do with it. I mean, since I started playing off so young, they've always taught me not to get big-headed. Isaac comes from a long line of musicians, with uncles on bass and keys, and a grandpa named Diz who can do this. It's really been the thing forever. We all just get together and play. Which is what makes this night so special for his family. The hottest ticket in town tonight. Where else would you be? All of his aunts and uncles wouldn't miss this for the world. I couldn't tell Isaac to break a leg tonight, but I did tell him to break a stick. <laughs> and neither would the fans of his new band. Tedeschi Trucks Band, it's a great band. Tedeschi Trucks. Seeing them here like five or six times. <laughs> Just making it onto this stage with the Tedeschi Truck Band is a story in itself. Isaac had moved down to the Gulf Coast and was picking up gigs wherever he could. One Thursday, the Tedeschi Trucks Band walked through the bar and hung out, and the other drummer, Falcon, he, he, was, he was listening. I had no idea he was even there. We were nerding out about drums. He sent me a snare drum was like, look, little brother, we're going to talk, man. We're going to be friends. You're going to know me your whole life. It's funny. I didn't know until recently how far Isaac's uh, <laughs> music went back, but I, you, you could tell instantly that it wasn't a hobby he just took on at some point. <laughs> so, but yeah, you can feel it. It's in, the, it's in the blood. Because as a drummer, his job is to keep time. Look at what he's done. It is amazing. The career that he's had already. As for his family, they can't wait to keep up. Having the best life I've ever imagined with, like the best people I've ever known, it's amazing, it feels great. Photojournalist Mike Rose, Chris Davis, News Channel 5.